We are here at another session of Michelin's Motor Show updates and the actions coming in fast from the Paris Motor Show 2018. And the car that we're going to be talking about, it's not a car actually, it's not really an SUV, but it's, it's something that I love. Porsche's Macan. Right, so it's the 2019 version that's debuted at Paris. The smallest SUV from Porsche then stands updated. I would be hard pressed to find the difference between the outgoing model and the, the new Macan because, well, yeah, you get new LED headlamps and uh, new LED tail lamps. But then, of course, there's this new thing that they've done at the back, which is very EV ish like, right? Correct. The connected like how, tail lamp. So, yeah, they're warming you with a little bit more of the tech and the features that yeah. you could have, like, even on the inside, right? Yeah. Now, before I jump into the inside, they're wowing you, but they didn't need to wow you because the Macan, by the way, happens to be the most sold Porsche ever. Rather, they've sold, what, 97,000. Macans, so much so that every third Porsche that is being sold would be a Macan. Even if you talk about the base petrol engine, which is the four-cylinder, two-liter petrol motor, yeah. it is so great to drive. You can look down upon it and say it's just the four-cylinder, it's just two liters. But the power is now reduced. Why? Yeah, it's down by a couple of horses, five about 5 PS yeah, and yeah. The, it, it has a particulate filter. This has changed the combustion chamber. I think basically it's running cleaner now. But thankfully, the acceleration and all is still in place. This is still a sub seven second SUV. Oh yes, and comes with the great seven speed PDK gearbox, that is Porsche Doppel Couplo. The reason why I avoided getting into the car earlier <laughs> when you asked is because I'm gonna have to eat my words. He's gonna break his promise again. Yes, I'm gonna talk about the touchscreen display. Because it's an 11 inch massive touchscreen display on the inside. That's that's like sitting in a theatre for me. We've spoken of 7 inch touchscreen displays, 6 inch, 8 inch maybe, 11 inch. The steering wheel is now new from the 911. Oh, okay. nice, nice. Apart from that, of course, you get uh, Porsche optional accessories on the inside. So Porsche abandoned diesel engines. Everybody's doing that in Europe. And so one would have assumed that they would come out with a Macan hybrid at the Paris Motor Show. Yeah, exactly. This was the big surprise. Yeah. Everybody was expecting because Porsche made the announcement that they're moving away from diesels. Yeah. And that, and at Paris, we've seen a lot of hybrids and EVs uh, break cover. So the Macan would have, it would have been, I guess, in line with what's happening at Paris to see the hybrid version of the Macan as well. But that's not there yet. Yeah. But we still have the LA Motor Show coming up, right? Oh. And, yeah. The one that we missed this year, you mean? No, no. LA Motor Show is still to come up. We, we, we're going to be there, right? We're going to be there. Are we going to be there? If this video, the Porsche Macan video, gets 10,000 likes once again, again, we will be doing the LA Motor Show, guys. And so please help us uh, know whether we should be going at LA Motor Show. Give this video some likes, yeah. Now, moving on to that question, I would like to, I would love to love the Macan, but for that I need to first know when does the Macan make its way into India? The right. new Macan, that is. Right, so I think uh, they're expecting deliveries for uh, the Macan to start in the first quarter of, I mean, start of 2019. I'm glad that they've not fiddled around with the formula too much. It is a car that works for me. Agreed, it's expensive for its size in the Indian market, specifically where we relate to cost and size so yeah. much. But still, its beauty remains intact. Thank God for that. And look forward to driving the 2019 version soon enough when it comes to India. Right? I certainly do. And I look forward towards more updates from Paris Motor Show and Intermot. It's 3 a.m. at night and you are supposed to say goodbye. Guess it's saying, say, 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 well, <laughs> adieu. Yeah. Is that the right Au revoir. Ah, oh, he's got the right yeah, language. Yeah. Yeah. Au revoir. Yeah. Au revoir, monsieur. Et aux jolies dames. Au revoir. Yeah, yeah, go, 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 go now. We're going to come up with more. Thank you very much for watching, guys. <laughs> goodbye. Oh, no, hold on, hold on. <laughs> Sorry, we, au revoir and, and so much for that, but, but we made a mistake. It's 3 a.m., that's why we're forgetting things, but we're having so much fun out here. The point that we missed out is yeah. this new off-road app that Porsche comes out with. Yeah. Macan, I mean, like, it's so, so much about on-road dynamics, and then Porsche comes out with this off-road, precision off-road app. Basically, it records what your off-road excursion was, what you did, I think what the vehicle did in terms of angles and how much wheel articulation and stuff like that. Are you going to do that with your Macan if you get one? Go off-road on it? Why are you so hell-bent on me loving the Macan and then getting it, would getting you do one it? and then going off-road in it? Yeah, would you go? In the Macan? Yeah. I think I'd do it. That, that's why they have that app now. Yeah, I would do it. No chance. Yeah. Would you do it? 
<laughs> Don't drop a comment for that, ladies and gentlemen. But do stay tuned. Do stay tuned. Do stay tuned. Do stay tuned. Stay, stay tuned. Stay tuned. For more updates from Paris Motor Show and in tomorrow, Varun and Priyadarshan are getting you lots of content, and so are we. Now the next few cars that we're going to talk about is Audi A4 and whatnot. See you soon.